Unit 16. The football match. Lesson 61. One. Read and act. Did you see the football match yesterday? Yes, I did. It was great. Did we win? No, we lost. Number 52 Middle School beat us five to three. Wow, that's a big score. Was it an exciting match? Yeah, I've never seen such an exciting match before. After 70 minutes, our team was winning three to two. So what happened? Their team scored three goals in the last 15 minutes. Half an hour later. Hi, Lele. Did you see the match yesterday? No, but I just saw Jim. He said he had seen it. So what was the result? We lost. They beat us five to three. Oh dear. Well, was it a good match? What did Jim think of it? He thought it was great. He said he had never seen such an exciting match before. Unit sixteen, the football match, lesson sixty-two, two, read. Girls beat boys, in a surprising result. The number sixty-nine middle school girls football team yesterday beat their school's boys team. The boys team used to help the girls with their training. They had never lost to the girls before, but this time the girls beat them four to three in an exciting match. After the game, Wu Nai, captain of the boys' team, was very unhappy. We all thought this would be an easy game, he said. We never thought a team of girls could beat us. This is the most unlucky day of my life. But Mr. Hu, the boys' PE teacher, said he thought the girls deserved to win. The boys were too confident, he said. I told them before the match that they needed to play well. They all thought that girls' football was a joke. Now they know better. They played carelessly, and they deserved to lose. The match had started well for the boys. After 30 minutes, they were winning two to zero. Their best striker, Lu Ming, scored in the 30th minute. Earlier, the midfield player Ma Zheng Chuan had scored the first goal in only the second minute of the match. His excellent shot went low to the left of the girl's goal. Their keeper Jiang Mei could not stop it. However, after the first half hour, the boys seemed to become too confident and relaxed. At first, the girls had felt a bit nervous, but then they became more and more confident. Just before halftime, Li Xiaolin made the score two to one with a beautiful shot into the top right-hand corner. Of the boys' goal. Unit sixteen, the football match. Lesson sixty-three, one, read. In the second half, the boys were the first to score. Another great shot from Lu Ming went over Jiang Mei's head and into the middle of the goal. However, after that, the boys became relaxed and lazy. But the girls carried on working hard. Hao Mei Ling scored in the 68th minute to make the score three to two. Then Li Xiaolin scored twice in the last six minutes to make the final score four to three. It was an amazing finish to an exciting match. The girls' PE teacher Miss Wang was very pleased with their performance. They were great, she said. I told them they could win. I told them that the most important thing was teamwork. The boys' team had some good players, but my girls were a better team. Three, read and act. Hi, Bill. How was the match yesterday? You didn't see it? No, I didn't know it started at two o'clock. I thought it started at five o'clock. By the time I got there, it had already finished. What was the score? I don't want to talk about it. You mean the girls won? Really? That's amazing. Yeah, they beat us four to three. They played very well, but we didn't. We're all very angry with ourselves. But I guess the girls are very pleased with themselves. Yes, of course.